I'm Reverend Olufolake Ike. Do you know what grace is about? Unmerited favor. That is to say, you will have a harvest that you wouldn't need to toil for. The Bible says he has given the travail to the wicked to mount up wealth and the treasure of darkness will be transferred unto you. You will experience grace in your finance. You will experience grace in your ministry. You will experience grace in your body. Grace on the lives of your children. Whatever you lay your hands to do, grace will cover it. And so favor will go before you. Favor will pursue you. Favor will go with you. Doors that have been shut against you, they are commanded to be opened by reason of this unmerited favor. The Lord will shine his face upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord will bless you. The Lord will keep you. His countenance will be upon you and he will give you peace. Just as in the beginning, the Bible says, even though darkness covers the earth, the Spirit of the Lord hovered upon the face of the deep and then the creation of the universe started. New things are beginning to be created in your life. Everlasting gates will have to lift up its head so that the King of Glory can come in. And you know where that King of Glory lives? He lives inside of you, both to will and to do his good pleasure. Christ in you is the hope of glory. Wherever the soles of your feet will step upon, the Lord will give you for a possession. It will give you a mouth and a wisdom that your adversary cannot gainsay or resist. The Lord will put upon you his favor so much so that when people see you, like when they saw Moses, they will see God and his glory arise and shine for your light has come because his glory is risen upon you men will come to your light kings will come to the brightness of your rising your name shall be called sought out people will seek you when jesus was born in bethlehem there were no flyers there were no radio announcements but his star rose up in the east and men and kings came seeking him because you carry the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings Jesus the Prince of Peace inside of you men will look for you with gifts in their hands wherever you go they will see God because he is alive in you I am awaiting your testimony first John 5 4 for whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. And this is the victory that overcometh the world, even our faith. Since I was young, I was young. and now I am old. The son of man that is your repair. I've never seen, I've never, 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 never seen the righteous forsaken.